Okay, we're here at GTI uh, Predictive Technologies. We're here with Joe Calaruso from Eastern Bering. Uh, we're going to be doing just a quick overall demo of our alignment system, which integrates with Vibro. Um, the first thing we've already done, just to let everybody know, we've already set the, this up on our simulator. And we have a little bit different simulator here. Normally, our motor would be our movable item, <clears throat> and the other end would be the stationary item. On this particular simulator, uh, for people that do know alignment, you might view this and think it's backwards. It's not. Uh, this is our movable, and that's where our M on our uh, alignment laser is on, and the S stationary is on the stationary end. And we have movable bo uh, bolts, and we've already done our shimming. So now that we've gotten everything all set up, uh, everything is, is on the machine, let's just quickly look at the screen here and see some of the options. And obviously, I can enter the machine ID, which we'll just quickly put test in there. Um, <clears throat> one of the other unique things about this is we can actually take a photo of what we're, uh, we're measuring. So we'll select the photo here and actually take a picture. You should be able to see this on the screen. So we'll take a photo of our, our setup. So maybe the next time we won't forget how we set, set everything up. <clears throat> and then, Joe, well, you did this for us already. We put in all the measurements. We measured from the, uh, the two uh, laser units to the two bolts, and all the measurements are here, as you can see. And uh, we're, we've already checked for soft foot, so we're going to check that off also. So uh, let's just do a quick um, remeasure so we can demonstrate exactly how this is measured. And it's telling me to measure my first position, which will be here in the 9 o'clock position. Uh, once it's green, you click to say measure. Then you move it to the 12 o'clock. Hit measure also. And you can see it turns yellow here. And I can, if I can't move any further and I'm in a circumstance that I can't go a full rotation or quarter rotation, I can hit that. But it is much better to find the green spot by going the full 90 degrees and clicking remeasure. And as you can see, normally we would have check marks uh, next to these where you see the stars. Um, and we've, we've, on this particular one, we've got um, stars instead of check marks. That means it's excellent. Not uh, So why don't you explain, Joe, what, what you see there and explain to us what the results are on the screen here. Okay, on the vertical, it's showing your vertical offset to be 0.3 mils and the angle 0.3 mils. Again, these readings are acceptable. And horizontally, we have half a mil with an angle of 0.2. Again, these tolerances are based on operating speed as well. So yeah, we put in 3,000. 3,000 RPM for this motor. So the tolerances are a little tighter the faster you're going. So again, the stars do indicate that this, this machine is well aligned. And pretty simple to use, I'd say. It's real simple to use. All right, well, we thank you for your attention for this video.